Hello fellow art lovers. Today we're going to draw a mosaic fish together. For this drawing tutorial, all you need is a paper, pencil, an eraser, any eraser. You'll be able to shade the fish sections with your pencil or with a pen if you prefer. Or if you want your fish to be colorful, then colored pencils or colored markers will work. The point of this video is for you to draw along with me so that by the end of this video we both have a nice drawing to hang on our walls. If at any point in this lesson you need more time to complete a step, just pause the video, work on your drawing, and then restart the video. So if you don't have your pencil and paper ready yet, pause the video and go get them. Okay, let's start. Let's draw the outside of the fish like this. Start at the middle of your page right here. Come in a little bit. Draw the fish's back. And then his tail fin. Then come down and do his belly. Come back out. Next we'll do the lower fin right here. Now this may seem weird at first but I want you to not start on the fish but come down a little bit and then make this fin down here. The upper fins we're going to do the same thing. Draw a line parallel to the top of your fish then put in your fins. Okay, so pause the video, draw your fish, put in the lower fin and the upper fin with a space in between the fins and the fish. When you're done with that, start the video. Now let's draw in the eye, the gill, and the side fin. Here's the center of the fish. Come up a little bit and put his eye right here. The gills are like crescent moons. Three of them. And the side fin looks something like this. You don't have to draw exactly the way I'm drawing. This is your drawing and you can draw it any way you want. For this side fin, we're going to do a line around the outside. We're making a space, a stripe, and I'll explain why. This is a mosaic fish drawing. These white spaces will be not colored. They will be like the grout in between tiles of a mosaic. We'll do more of that later. Let's next put on the band that goes between the fish and the tail. Make four lines. Not supposed to be touching. There. Four lines. One will be white, two spaces will be colored. Then we'll put in some white stripes in the tail. Okay, so pause the video, 
and get in your stripes, your fins, your eyes, your gills, and the stripes on the fins. Then restart the video. Now we'll put in the mosaic sections of the rest of the body. The trick is to remember to draw the white stripes or strips that create the mosaic sections. I'll draw some at random. You do not have to draw your sections the same way I draw mine. Every fish will be different. Later on we'll color in the sections. It can be any shape you want them to be, or any size. Whenever you feel ready, pause the video and put in your sections. If you haven't done that yet, pause the video and put in your sections. Now you should have a fish that looks something like this. It's up to you whether you want to fill in the mosaic sections with your pencil or a pen or colored markers or colored pencils. But whatever you choose, be sure you leave these white strips blank. I'm going to use colored pencils for my drawing. I got these pencils at the dollar store. They're fine for this work. So what we don't want to do is put the same color right next to itself. So we want to mix the colors up. So start with any color you want and start coloring into the spaces. If you haven't done so yet, Pause the video and use all the colors that you want. Try not to have the same color right next to each other, but if it works out that way, that's fine. And when your fish is completely colored in, start restart the video. So here's my finished fish. I hope you like it. I hope you like the one that you did. If there's a Facebook link in the description below, you can post your drawing on the Skillful Artist Facebook page so we all can see it. I also suggest that you frame your drawing. I have a few frames I can use. Let me show you. I like that one. It's nice. Oh, I think I like this one better. So I can put my name right down here. You can do your signature on yours. If you like drawing with me today, 
subscribe, hit the thumbs up icon, and click the bell to be notified when I post another Draw With Me video. A better way to be notified is to join my email list over at skillfulartist.com. Then you'll get an email with our tips and details about other videos. And you can also contact me directly by emailing Elaine at skillfulartist.com. Keep drawing, dear art lovers, and join me in the next drawing video.